Hello and welcome to the True Stories channel. Today, we're taking you on a journey through time. We'll explore the prehistoric secrets of South America and examine how the first humans reached this continent and interacted with its gigantic creatures. These new discoveries, which have stirred great excitement in the archaeological world, could fundamentally change what we know about history. If you're ready, let's dive into the depths of these fascinating discoveries. South America is home to one of the most intriguing and mysterious chapters of human history. Archaeologists and scientists continue to make new discoveries to better understand the history of this continent. Recent research on the first human settlements in South America is set to revolutionize what we know about prehistoric periods. This research helps us understand when and how the first humans reached South America, how they survived in this harsh environment, and how they interacted with gigantic mammals. For many years, scientists believed that modern humans reached the Americas about 16,000 years ago after leaving Africa. However, new findings in Argentina are turning this theory on its head. Fossils discovered along the banks of the Reconquista River suggest that the first humans arrived in South America much earlier, around 21,000 to 25,000 years ago. These findings are a source of great excitement, not only for archaeologists, but also for historians. This discovery is an important development that challenges known history and raises new questions about when and how the first humans reached the continent. At the heart of the discovery are the fossils of a gigantic ancestor of modern armadillos, known as glyptodont. These massive creatures weighed about 300 kilograms, and were 180 centimeters long. Glyptodonts were known for their thick and large bony shells. This armor protected them from environmental threats, and these giant mammals played a crucial role in the ancient ecosystem of South America. Archaeologists found cut marks on the glyptodont fossils made with stone tools. These marks indicate that the first humans hunted these giant mammals and consumed their meat. The areas where the cut marks were found show that the early settlers targeted the meaty parts of the animal, giving us clues about their survival strategies. During this period, the world was going through a process known as the last glacial maximum. This period, lasting from 26,000 years ago to 19,000 years ago, covered much of North America with ice sheets. This was just one of the environmental challenges faced by the first people migrating to South America. The cold and arid climate of the glacial period made the survival struggle of these people even more difficult. However, these harsh conditions did not stop the first humans from journeying to America. These migrations serve as incredible evidence of human resilience and adaptability. Researchers note that during this period, people not only survived but also adapted to the challenging environmental conditions. The stone tools discovered in South America help us understand how the first humans survived in this harsh environment and hunted large animals like the massive glyptodonts. These tools serve functions such as cutting, digging, and chipping, and these functions reveal the complexity of their hunting strategies. By using these tools, the first humans targeted the meaty parts of giant mammals, which may have increased their chances of survival. These discoveries offer a new perspective on the hunting and survival skills of early humans. Recent discoveries suggest that the first migrations to South America occurred much earlier than we thought. The 25,000 year old ornaments found in Brazil and the approximately 21,000 year old footprints discovered in New Mexico are among the significant evidence supporting this notion. These findings show that human migrations to the continent were much more complex and ancient than we previously believed. These new discoveries have sparked widespread debate in the scientific community. Scientists are questioning how these findings affect what is known about history and what new theories might emerge. New evidence of when the first humans reached South America requires us to rethink our understanding of the continent's history. Interaction with gigantic mammals like glyptodonts 
plays a critical role in understanding the survival strategies of prehistoric human communities. These massive creatures were not only a food source, but also a part of societal and cultural practices. The cut marks found on fossils show that this interaction was not only for survival, but also carried social and cultural significance. How the first humans interacted with these gigantic creatures gives us important clues about their hunting skills and social structures. Researchers state that these interactions have physiological as well as cultural dimensions. These findings allow us to gain more insight into the complex social structures and survival strategies of prehistoric humans. These new studies on the first human settlements in South America may lead to a rewriting of history. These discoveries not only raise new questions about the continent's history, but also offer a deeper understanding of the lifestyles of prehistoric human communities. Future excavations and technological advancements may provide more information about the lives of these ancient peoples. Archaeologists will continue to uncover the stories of the first humans struggling to survive in these harsh environmental conditions. Future research may further illuminate this mysterious past and offer new perspectives on human history. How the first humans reached South America, interacted with these gigantic mammals, and survived in these harsh conditions remains one of history's greatest mysteries. The exploration and settlement of South America is a topic that fascinates not only historians and archaeologists, but also the general public. The paths prehistoric human communities took to reach this continent, the kind of life they led, and how they adapted to environmental challenges remain a source of curiosity for researchers. These people not only survived, but also created complex communities by establishing cultural and social structures. These communities flourished in various regions of South America for thousands of years, enriching our understanding of the continent's history. The arrival of the first humans in South America also provides important insights into prehistoric migration routes and the reasons behind these migrations. Scientists propose various hypotheses to understand the reasons for these migrations. Factors such as climate changes, tracking game animals, and social pressures are thought to be among the main driving forces behind these migrations. Researchers use interdisciplinary approaches to understand the complexity and multi-layered nature of these early migrations. Approaches to understand the complexity and multi-layered nature of these early migrations. In conclusion, these new discoveries about the first human settlements in South America bring to light stories lost in the depths of history. Archaeologists and scientists are trying to understand the lifestyles, social structures, and responses to environmental challenges of these ancient communities. These discoveries reshape what is known about history and offer a broader perspective on human history. The complex structures, survival strategies, and social interactions of prehistoric human communities continue to intrigue historians and archaeologists. Thank you for watching. If you enjoy this kind of content and want to continue our journeys into the depths of history, don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Feel free to share your comments and thoughts with us. See you in the next video.